Rocketeer, written by Joanne M. Dickinson, illustrated by Daria Shamolina. I'm Riley. I build things like engines and sprockets. To some, I'm the girl who can build parts for rockets. I want to be known as the young Rocketeer who declares, have no fear while I'm dressed in my gear. So one day, I'll become all I'm hoping to be. And I'd like this decision to be up to me. I would love blasting off through the Earth's atmosphere with the rocket I built as a skilled rocketeer. I will fly in my rocket throughout space and back. My friend Cosmo will ride in the safe storage rack. When I'm up there, I'll gaze at the moon and the stars. I will visit the planets you can't reach with cars. I'll blast off to the moon, which will be so much fun to meet aliens and Martians. My journey's begun. I'll see Mercury, Venus, so close to the sun. They're just too hot to visit and must weigh a ton. Now, majestic Earth, third, where it so often rains, is fifth largest with mountains, deep canyons, and plains. Planet Earth is high tech with its cars, planes, and trains. They can be so appealing to those with keen brains. We know Mars is the planet that's fourth from the sun. As my friend then explains, it's the red, dusty one. Massive Jupiter, sixth. I will now blow your mind. It has more than the mass of all planets combined. Well, the gas giant, Saturn's magnificent rings and its yellowish colors show beauty that sings. Then Uranus and Neptune, ice giants, they say. They are seventh and eighth from the sun, far away. It's so risky to visit them both as my rocket could crack a head gasket or fracture a socket. Dwarf Pluto, no longer considered a planet. From Earth, it looks small like a round pomegranate. Our large solar systems, a band of soft light, where the stars of the Milky Way twinkle at night. I observe the dark sky, and I dream I'm on Mars. As a girl in a rocket, I'll reach for the stars. In the driver's seat, soon I'll be taking my place. I will quickly take off to explore outer space.